Hello you cool cats, this is Mina with another Danganronpa 3 anime Let's Watch episode. It's episode 5, Future Arc 3, Cruel Violence and Hollow Words. I don't have much to say other than I'm sad that Aoi died. Like, I don't know what else to say. That was, that was kind of shocking that she would die so early on, too. I thought it would be way more dramatic, so I... I don't... Yeah. Wow. But let's go on and watch the this episode. I imagine it's going to be really sad. Here we go. What? Oh, it's a fake... It's a fake dagger thing. Oh no, they killed the great Gozu? <gasps> oh dude, that's messed up. Is that... Does that resemble what he looked like in his death picture at the beginning of the episode. I'll know in a second because we haven't actually ran through the um, the intro, but holy smokes, he died. He was so beastly. Who killed him? The only people in this room are um, Makoto, Aoi, and the handicap girl. Also, is everybody going to be hung up when they die? Because he's like tangled up in, in the ceiling. You know what this means? This means that, um, since, since Aoi's was a red herring, I don't think she's going to die. I'm pretty sure, like, I'm going to throw down the, uh, my guess that 100% she's going to live now. Because I think this was just a, a red herring. So he was hung, but this doesn't look like his death exactly. So I think maybe these aren't all going to be correct in the way that they're showing their deaths. I see. Okay. 13 people left alive. That's, that's right. Right? I believe so. Yeah. So, did someone break into this room while everyone was knocked out? Because the only people in here is the handicapped girl. Ugh. I, I keep, I should look up her name again. Oh. Gekko Gahara. Gekko Gahara. He won't. He won't eat anything she's giving him. I wonder if his is that he can't eat anything. I can't tell if she's supposed to be suspicious just because she's able to do so much with, like, the the inner workings of the building and thusly that makes her suspicious because of Monokuma or if she's also su suspicious because she has Monami. Um, but... At the same time, she seems to just be helpful, so I, I don't know. But she was in this room with us. Makes her a little suspicious. She was doing a twirly motion when she, when she turned. Oh, Makoto. <laughs> I didn't even think too much about it. I thought she was just being silly. So it's hers that she can't, she can't turn right? Oh, no. He shared what his secret action is with her. That makes me a little nervous. Now, now she, now she knows what his for an, for an action is. No. Now I'm, now I'm like, I'm triple worried. Oh my gosh. Allie's is be hit with a punch or a kick. That is so easy. All she needs to do is get punched or kicked. And there are people in this building that will surely do that. Oh my gosh. That's terrifying. There's a helicopter literally trying to kill him. It's really cool that you get to see the moment where um, Hajime and Makoto met. Oh my god, he actually broadcasted that to everyone. This guy is ridiculous. What do you know? Makoto's been through enough. No one needs to experience absolute despair to have hope with inside themselves. That's ridiculous. The, the notion that you need to truly feel absolutely... The, 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 the fact that you need to experience the very pit of despair in order to save the world is ridiculous. I'm a little nervous about these two their behavior with each other is I really feel that one of them's gonna die horribly 
feel like it's gonna be this guy. Because <laughs> I'm getting like some serious my Zono vibes off of um this girl right here. Ruka. Yeah, she's giving me some my Zono vibes. There's some there's some tensions between this psycho girl and Uruka. I don't know what happened between them, but some sort of weird drug. Uh she's about to die from overdose of whatever she's consuming there. Dude, what anime did I just step into? I still feel really nervous that Kiri Gary is with these two. I wouldn't expect like the the real mastermind to show off that they're dangerous right away. So I'm still extremely I don't feel good about it. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm totally right. He can't use doors. That's why he's cutting into the glass right there. Like I get it. He's experienced true horrors. But, again, it's stupid to argue this. What what good is killing Makoto over this? Nothing's good about it. Like, if you kill everyone that's on your side, you leave no one left besides yourself. And that's not, that's not exactly a hope worth fighting for. <sighs> he agreed that Makoto can possibly create hope and then he's like now I'm gonna kill you it totally this guy is nuts use your words to stop my blade from hitting you oh boy wouldn't it be crazy if, like, his girlfriend was the one who started this whole thing, like, masterminded it all? I don't think that's going to be the case, but wouldn't that be nuts? Then what is he going to say? Oh, 